let's keep this intro short and sweet. This is a dictionary of terms I put together for new players of Final Fantasy XIV and new to MMO players alike. I'll discuss exceptions to rules or how people use these terms at some points. Below in the description is a link to a Google Doc with the full script of this dictionary. Let's get started. FFXIV, Final Fantasy XIV, ARR, A Realm Reborn, HW, Heavensward, SB, Stormblood, SHB, Shadowbringers, EW, and Walker. Expansion names are taken from the first letter of each word. Because both Stormblood and Shadowbringers would both be SB, we add an H for Shadowbringers since it came second. MSQ, Main Scenario Quest, the main story of the game. Follow these through the whole game for a fantastic story and a journey through every expansion. The Rolls, DPS, Damage per second, damage dealers of the party, responsible for doing the bulk of the party's damage. Healer, responsible for keeping the party alive, can do damage when no healing is needed. Tank, responsible for taking the brunt of enemy attacks, keeps enemies on them by doing damage. These three roles together are referred to as the Trinity System. Class. The base professions of a role. There are a total of 20 classes in the game, and no more will ever be added. Here is a list of every class and their abbreviations, as well as their class icons. Battle. Nine classes. Lancer. Archer. Conjurer. Rogue. Marauder. Arcanist. Pugilist. Thaumaturge. Gladiator. Crafter, 8 classes, Leatherworker, Carpenter, Blacksmith, Armorer, Culinarian, Alchemist, Weaver, Goldsmith, Gatherer, 3 classes, Botanist, Fisher, Miner. Job, the advanced form of a role requiring the use of a job stone. Only battle professions have jobs. Each battle class has one job, with the exception of Arcanist, which has two. Further, all jobs added by expansions do not have classes. They begin as jobs. As of Endwalker, there are 19 jobs in the game. Dragoon, Bard, White Mage, Ninja, Warrior, Summoner, Scholar, Monk, Black Mage, Paladin, Machinist, Astrologian, Dark Knight, Samurai, Red Mage, Dancer, Gunbreaker, Reaper, Sage. Despite them being different, many people mistakenly use class and job interchangeably. Limited Job Further distinct is the Limited Job. Limited Jobs do not have classes and come with a number of limitations as the name implies. Included is not being able to solo queue for duties. They should be considered separate content and in essence, special minigames. We currently only have one Limited Job, but there is potential for more in future. And that job is Blue Mage. D-O-W, D-O-M, D-O-H, D-O-L. The proper terminology for professions as used by the game, Disciple of War, Magic, Hand, and Land. Battle professions are Disciples of War and Magic. Crafters are Disciples of the Hand. Gatherers are Disciples of the Land. Skill Notation. Skills are most often abbreviated, much like expansions when used in guides, the first letter of each word. Without prior context to a conversation, such as which class or job is being referred to, a specific abbreviation will not mean anything. As such, 
keep skill abbreviations to a minimum and use full words to prevent confusion. Proc. A bastardized term to mean when one skill activates another. For example, Archer gets a proc very early on. Heavy Shot has a 20% chance to activate the use of Straight Shot. This is a 20% proc rate. Procs can come in other forms as well, but most often act like this within Final Fantasy XIV. Potency. Skills have a listed potency on them. This is a linear measure of power compared to other skills within your own skill set. An attack of 200 potency will do double the damage of an attack of 100 potency. Healing potency works the same way. There is however damage variance and a number of factors that can make this not seem so. Damage variance. Damage variance in itself is to say all attacks do not do the same damage every time. If the base damage of an attack is 1000 and it has a 10% damage variance, it will do anywhere from 900 to 1100 damage. DH. Direct hit is both a stat we will go into later and an effect on your damage. These will happen at random and will cause your attack to do roughly 25% more damage. Heals cannot direct hit, often called a mini crit. Crit. Similar to direct hit, crit is critical hit. They randomly occur and cause higher damage from your attacks. These are less common than a direct hit but hit much harder at around 40%. Heals can be critical heals. DHC. DH and crits can happen separately, but if they both happen at the same time, your damage increases further for a direct hit crit, or simply direct crit. These are multiplicative, so roughly this would be a 75% damage boost. Dot, damage over time. Hot, heal over time. Many skills will say damage or healing over time on them. A dot or hot will do damage or heal repeatedly over the skill's duration. To get the total power of one of these skills, use the following formula. Duration of the dot divided by 3. Multiply this by the potency of the dot. And then add on any base damage from the attack that applied the dot. Server ticks. How often the game servers update or keep track of certain pieces of info. The 3 in the previous dot formula is due to server ticks. Our server ticks occur every 3 seconds, and so when the server ticks, a dot will also tick and do damage. The actual mechanics of server ticks can be gone into much deeper, but here I will keep it simple. GCD. Global cooldown, OGCD, off global cooldown. Here in Final Fantasy XIV, a GCD is any skill called a weapon skill or spell in the tooltips. All skills under these terms are on the global cooldown. It is global because all skills share the cooldown. If you use one skill on the GCD, all skills on the GCD will go on cooldown. Base GCD is 2.5 seconds. This also separates off global skills, as they do not go on cooldown when using a global cooldown skill. OGCDs typically do not share cooldowns at all. They also have much longer cooldowns from as low as 15 seconds up to 7 minutes, called abilities in the tooltip. Weave, weaving, double weaving. To use one or two OGCDs between GCDs. This is referred to as weaving and is proper use of OGCD abilities. Again, the base GCD is 2.5 seconds. That is 2.5 seconds that you can be using abilities not on the GCD or weave them between GCDs. Clipping. Cutting into GCD time, buff time, or dot time. When weaving, a potential issue is clipping your GCD. 
This refers to when it takes longer for you to use your OGCDs than the length of your GCD. If you have a GCD of 2.5 seconds and it takes you 2.6 seconds to weave two OGCD abilities in after your previous GCD, this clips your GCD by 0.1 seconds. When referring to buffs or dots, it refers to when you refresh your buff timer or dot timer before it ran out. Depending on the job or buff, clipping your buffs is intended and good. Positionals. Bonus effects from executing an attack from a specific enemy location. Flank. Sides of the enemy. Rear. Behind the enemy. Some skills come with positional bonuses for being to the sides or rear of an enemy when using it. Positionals as a term is often used to refer to the skills themselves and the bonuses of the skills. LB, Limit Break. A special, powerful ability that uses the limit break bar that appears when in a party of four players or more. It comes in three levels, based on the number of bars filled. Each level of LB is stronger than the previous. The bar is shared across the party, emptying the bar after anyone uses it. Each roll has a different limit break, with the DPS separated into three rolls. Melee DPS, a large attack on a single enemy. Ranged DPS, a line attack that hits all enemies within the line. Magic DPS, a circular attack that hits all enemies within the circle. Healer. Heals everyone within range of the healer. LB3 will also raise any fallen players. Tank. Damage reduction to everyone in range of the tank. AoE. Area of effect. This refers to a type of attack, the range of those attacks, and enemy attack indicators. An AoE attack is one that attacks within an area, and hits multiple enemies. The attack has an AoE, or an area of effect. The orange circles an enemy telegraphs with are enemy AoEs. The shape and color can vary based on the enemy and the attack type. Avoid these areas. Blue AoEs in duties with NPC allies are allied AoEs, and are safe to stand in. By the way, NPC means non-player character. Opener. The order of skill usage in the opening moments of an encounter, often optimized for maximum damage. Rotation. How you rotate through your skills over the duration of a fight, often follow some sort of repeating pattern. Mobs. A generic term to refer to enemies, or a group of enemies. Trash. Non-boss enemies outside of boss encounters. Adds. Non-boss enemies inside of boss encounters. Short for additional enemies. These terms are often all used interchangeably, calling trash adds or adds trash. Enmity. Aggro. Threat. Other terms used to measure enemy anger towards a target. All actions generate some level of enmity, with tanks having abilities or weapon skills that come with enmity multipliers. As a result, enmity is mostly a tank mechanic, but not exclusively something DPS and healers should ignore. Single pool. Engage a single group of enemies, or even a single enemy where applicable. Big pool. Engage multiple groups of enemies at once. Wall-to-wall -wall pool, a variant of big pools where the tank continues to engage enemies until they hit a literal wall and cannot continue further into the dungeon. Said wall can be a door that will open after the enemies are all defeated. The start of the pool is from the previous wall, hence wall-to-wall. -wall. Chain pool, engaging a single group of enemies repeatedly before the previous set dies. Example, pulling enemy set 1, getting the enemies to 50% health, then running to engage a second set of enemies. This is almost exclusively a bad idea in Final Fantasy XIV. 
exceptions can exist, but in general, do not chain pull. Empty, main tank, OT, off tank, lowercase mt, mistel. With an 8 player or 24 player duties, there will be multiple tanks. The main tank is the tank currently with the enmity lead and has the attention of the boss. Off tanks are the tanks not currently holding enmity and focusing on doing damage or using supportive skills when applicable. They are also usually in charge of any adds that appear. If the main tank dies, the off tank should be ready to take the enmity lead before the boss heads off to kill a healer. Some bosses will require two or three main tanks. This can be based purely on the game specifically targeting alive tanks, or based on who is first or second in enmity totals. Despite sharing letters, MT can also mean the entirely separate mistell, or when someone sends a message in the wrong chat location, similar to wrong chat or other such terms. MT and lowercase MT are also sometimes used interchangeably. By request and for viewing experience, this has been split into two separate videos. The part two is down below in the description. There's a lot more terms to go over.